In California, the future for inmates in the firefighting program burns brightly, with reformed men and women taking advantage of the Ventura Training Center to help them re-enter society. Christina Rodriguez has more on the program and what it takes. Yes, sir. Thank you. Sean Chester is on the road with Cal Fire Ventura, combating the lake fire. I just got on the wrong path and headed down the wrong direction, and then uh, wound up in a situation where I recognized that I needed to make some changes in my thought processes. But this isn't the first time he's been away from home. Chester served time in prison. While completing his sentence, he joined an inmate fire crew now he's a free man and is halfway through the fire academy with ventura training center one of the few programs of its kind in the nation now they're being separated from their families for good decisions for a sacrifice a commitment to the state a commitment to their victims uh, a commitment to their families today i tell the guys this is a sacrifice worth making the ventura training center currently has 57 cadets all battling the lake fire once they uh, get released from, from, from incarceration, they now come to our offices and we can assist them with jobs, housing, education, and therapy services, give them the tools so they don't go back to prison. VTC has graduated over 200 firefighters since opening its program in 2018. They got to be resilient, they got to be able to follow orders, and they got to work hard, you know, because on the application process, uh, there's a not recommended, recommended, and highly recommended. And we're looking for that highly recommended. We're looking for that guy that's willing to take advantage of the second chance and to come home and not just have a job but have a career. I would implore any currently incarcerated individual who is part of the FIRE program to uh, really seek this program out. It's, it's life-changing. It's an opportunity of a lifetime. I'm News Channel reporter Christina Rodriguez.